and we're gonna give you an inside peek on our new show, Battle of the Bling. Well, let's talk a little bit about this show, Battle of the Bling. What are HGTV fans getting themselves into when they get to sit down and watch this show? It is a wild roller coaster ride of decor, of personalities, of experiences. It's really, really insane. And I really, really love getting to see how these people who are cut from a very similar cloth as I am, how they live and how they make their space be an expression of them. If you are a human being who likes things that are over the top, you should express that in your home. It'll probably make you a much happier person when you're in your safe space. And these people understand that, and boy, do they run with it. Is it pretty humbling for you to be able to join this incredible family of HGTV and bring your authentic self to the screen? Absolutely. There was a time not too long ago where I would have thought like I am probably not someone that the HGTV audience would like to see or would welcome into their homes. But I love that things are changing and that people are being so progressive. And, and I like the fact that Kim and I are both people of color. That's a very rare thing. And I applaud HGTV for putting two black voices up on camera and letting us go into all of these homes of different backgrounds, religious beliefs, ethnicities, orientations, and just talk talking about homes because I think that every single person has the right to feel seen and um, and feel represented on television. And I love that HGTV is, they've always been that, by the way, this is nothing new for them. They've always had queer voices on their network, but I'm just happy to be joining the HGTV Hall of Fame and Fabulosity at this point. <laughs> Fantastic. I completely agree. Well, and I have to say, as someone who's a fan of HGTV, I'm also just a fan of reality TV and seeing that you have run the gamut, honey. You've been a contestant on shows. You've been a judge on shows. Now you get to say you're a host. Is it kind of cool to see that, like, you have the triple crown when it comes to reality TV? <laughs> um, this is not something I ever thought that I would be doing. I, I, reality TV is not something that I, like, ever aspired to do, but it has taught me a lot. It's taught me a lot about myself, and I've gotten to learn a lot of valuable lessons since this last tour that I just did was with a bunch of like alumni from RuPaul's Drag Race. And it's really awesome to get to be a peer of theirs and not have to be a host or a judge or a choreographer, um, just to be in the room and get to know them in a way that I never could, even though we worked together on camera. And there was a lot of tongue popping, clapping, snapping, and death dropping in the audiences, which is, you know, what I came to do. I feel like you've done a little bit of everything, which is so crazy. And by the way, in case you don't hear it enough, just props to you for having such thick skin. This is a tough, industry to be in and you've had a lot thrown your way throughout this roller coaster of entertainment that you've been on so props to you for just holding your head up high and continuing to find work after work because it's not easy out there thank you ricky i appreciate that so much it, it, it means a lot to me by the way you're you have my parents last name my stepdad's last name um is yours so maybe we're related somehow ricky maybe you're my long lost brother oh my gosh could you imagine i would love it if we were some long lost sisters where is ancestry.com when we need her you gotta get a 23 and me started stat okay because this whole interview might just be more juicy than we thought oh my gosh this is what i'm saying imagine the follow-up interview it's like wait so who was your mom and how did we miss that <laughs> yeah and do you still want to see these thirst traps now that we're brothers though these are the questions that people really want to know ricky well, we gotta I can get down to the bottom of this i can say the answer is still yes <laughs> okay okay work okay come on I'm howling.